Folks, listen, I'm excited about today because I'm about to introduce the biggest panel I've ever done on this show. Normally, I do two, three people, sometimes one. This is the big one. TV personality and weekly advice columnist on Sirius XM's Dirty Pop, Kim Cravell. <laughs> and my longtime friend, she's the author of The Strawberry Letters. She does them every morning on my radio show. She's been by my side for 15 years. My girl, Shirley Strawberry. <laughs> and outspoken reality star, Nicole Paluzzi. Uh, Paluzzi, Paluzzi, who Paluzzi. many... Paluzzi. Paluzzi. <laughs> Pepperoni. <laughs> who many of you know as Snooky. I love this girl. She's my friend. Okay. And, and, and this is Snooky. <laughs> I love her. And then showing off a shirt from her new clothing line, Jay Wow. Say hello to Jenny Farley, <laughs> AKA Jay Wow. All right, let's go. Okay, listen to this. Here we go. A uh, 23 year old Selena Gomez is apparently changing her image. She's posed nude for the cover of her latest album, Revival. Uh, now, it's got some people questioning does this simply prove the old saying, sex sales? Kim? Well, she did it originally because she had got some criticism from the media. She had put on a few pounds, and she says she wanted to show the world that she's not ashamed of her body. But I say, put your flipping clothes on, kid. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, these young girls are so much more than this. This is what kills me. It breaks my heart because, yes, Steve, sex does sell, but that don't mean you got to sell it. Find a different way to put yourself out there. <laughs> yeah. Now, is this gonna hurt her career? Probably not. But will it hurt her character? That remains to be seen. I disagree. Mm -hmm. Of course she does. I think she did it in the most beautiful way. She didn't do it in the Miley Cyrus way. She's not showing nipples. She's not showing nipples. She's not vag. showing her vagina. Or what? Vag? Her, <laughs> I, vagina. vagina. I call it a poo cat. That's what <laughs> we call it back when we grow up. <laughs> she did it classy and it's a yeah. cat. A poo done. cat. What? <laughs> And it's true, sex yeah. does sell. At the end of the day, my boobs sold a lot for the Jersey Shore. Yeah, yeah. but you sex sells, see the house. sex sells, <laughs> sex sells. But put an older woman up there, put Barbara Streisand, put Aretha. Okay, put Shirley. Okay, then how well, how many albums will they sell? Seriously, this is all about out. her getting her getting Aretha attention. Yeah. Put, I'm saying, <laughs> if it's true, if it's true, if it's true that sex sells, then let's try it with everybody and see how much will sell. You know, it just works when you're young and beautiful, and she's just doing it for attention oh, oh. to sell some albums. She's trying to change her image. That's how she's doing it. I think it. she right. wants I to make a statement. Mm -hmm. Women are beautiful, and sometimes, you know, it's nice to, to show, like, our physical features show like that. Not like a boob or, you know, But it's there, about but... the music, yes. though. It's about well, yeah, the music. Yeah, but you also need to no. sell the package. package. Okay, ladies, here's my take on it. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I think that everything now is for shock value. I agree yes, with you, Stacey. That's all it's about. It's not about your music. It's not about your body being beautiful. If you look on the red carpet today mm -hmm. at an award show, mm -hmm. the dresses are more and more revealing. Great. When J-Lo wore that Versace that went down here. Oh, yeah. That's conservative. Yeah. That's conservative. That's, that's conservative. nothing yeah. now. That's right. I was going to wear an outfit just like that. I know. I was going to drive down here and my phone. We talked her out of it. Producer said, you can't do that, Kim. I said, why? I'm just showing my body. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right, all right, let's move on. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's talk about it. Elizabeth Hasselbeck is getting serious pushback after saying the Black Lives Matter movement should be considered a hate group. Her reasoning is that the message has launched increased mm -hmm. violence against police. And so is this just someone trying to make headlines or does she have a point, Kim? I'm gonna quote Shakespeare here. Oh, okay. A tale told by an idiot is full of sound and fury signifying nothing. And that's exactly <laughs> what's going on. <laughs> Well, absolutely. This, this incensed me when she said this. I, I could not believe she was this stupid. Then I, <laughs> I, I just couldn't believe it because we all know what this serious movement came from. It came from black teenagers and men unarmed being killed in the streets. So it made us think that do they not care about us? We have families. We are alive. Our lives should matter. Mm -hmm. That's how the movement was born. 
So for her to say something like that, I'm like, really, Elizabeth, are they getting the band back together on The View? So you trying to, <laughs> what, get fired and get your old job back? Wow. What yeah. is really going on wow. here? Yeah. Yeah. You know, seriously, yeah. it, it's terrible. Nicole. I mean, we've been on The View a couple of times when she was on, mm -hmm. and she never really seemed like a nice, genuine person. It's always wow. like she wanted to yeah. say something to like get out there. And mm -hmm. I just think anything, I'm not surprised that she said this because she's always been saying stupid yeah, she got crap like this. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, I'm a floor, but she always does that. She said, to break it down, <laughs> she's always said yeah. stupid stuff. I, I, that's what I feel. It was stupid and well, it was insensitive. You know, okay, this, this, to say that the campaign Black Lives Matter should be labeled a hate group that's because it promotes further violence against the police. Let me tell you something. The slogan Black Lives Matter was not to say that other lives don't. Black Lives Matter... <laughs> What Black Lives Matters is trying to get the attention is, all lives matter. Can Black Lives Matter just the same? That's right. That's all. That's it. It cannot be less. And we're just as upset, Steve, about the police officers who lost their lives as well. Yes. Just as upset to me. about them. A police officer can't yeah. come to work and get killed? No. You think we cool with that? Are you crazy? But, but Steve, it's the us and them mentality, right? It's us against them. We're, we're one. Yeah. We're all bleed red. That's, That's why what she said you know what? makes what she said so stupid. I, I agree with See, you children, I agree. It, if it, you put children nice. in a daycare center, who have never been taught hate, yes. they don't know what hate is. They love. They the love. black kids play with the white kids, the and time. they play with the black, and they don't do nothing. It's a learned behavior. It is, it is a learned behavior. It, it's amazing, man, how we grow up. And, but when you see the KKK with little bitty babies with Klan's robes on, oh, oh. I, I just feel so damn, man. Sure. Here, this little baby, oh. this little gift from God, he's going to get taught with this little Klan outfit on to be a Klansman. <laughs> what do he know about hating me? Yeah. Why would this little boy hate me? Well, if I saw him in a, with a Klan outfit on and the car was on fire, I would try to get him out the car. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Yeah. I would try to yeah. get him out the car. Yeah. 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 Now, if it's a grown man in there with a Klan outfit on, I, I don't know. You would, Steve. You would. You'd still do it. I'm going to try, try to get him out, but I'm going to slow it down yeah. a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm going to get him out yeah. the car, though. Bottom line. I'm going to get him out the car. And then I'm going I'm, to do this here and put it on his lips <laughs> <laughs> and record it. You've been kissed by a black man. <laughs> <laughs> we got more trending topics up next. Stay with us. We'll be back. <laughs>